What's up everybody? We're DVTV and at the moment we are at beautiful Bali. Today we are out to explore and our first stop is Tegenugan Waterfall. Let's check out the waterfall. Oh, I go. take a break we're driving from Changu to a little bit north of Denpazar and it is a long sore ride oh my butt is so sore right now our scooter is not the best and yeah it hurts it hurts but at least you can find nice places to stop like this pretty gorgeous We got our tickets for 15 rupiah, rupiah yeah. each. Please. It already feels a bit touristy, like as you said, there's like markets and restaurants set up. It seems for to be you. a theme in Bali, yeah. like little markets at every destination. We also read that this is the biggest and most popular, like tourist-wise, waterfall. I think we so. get a view already right there. See what oh, we shit. can see. So we arrived at the waterfall. It's just a two minute walk from the parking lot. It's very close to the actual waterfall, which makes the adventure factor a little smaller. And you walk through all these stalls for just two minutes and then you're above this valley. I just feel like the adventure factor could be a little higher. I need a little hike to a waterfall and then it has to appear out of the jungle. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I agree. A lot of places in Bali that we've been to so far have been set up for tourism or like Instagrammable photos. Like we could, we see this little nest you can look down there and you see these like little heart benches and everything. It feels like it's set up for like photo taking and tourism. It's it gorgeous. Looks it looks really pretty. And I'm sure it looks better when you're down. Yes. So let's do that. Oh, hello. So we're in another bird's nest. Yeah, another <laughs> Instagram spot here. It's really nice. You see all the green, you feel like a bird. Yeah. We're birds together. Oh. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> we made it down about 20 steps and we got to a bird nest. We'll see what else is there. Yeah, the trash can shot. Found the next picture spot. It's a heart. as uh, a small uh, one in the background. Very nice. So it's about half past 10 and today was a little gloomy so far. It was not that hot but now the sun is coming out and I'm starting to sweat. I'm rocking pretty nice under boob sweat here. You're made for warm climates, I'm not. I'm a lion. Ah! Well, we made it down the stairs, it's very short. It's like a two minute walk but uh, with all the selfie spots it might take you half an hour to get down. Looks nice, those big rocks in the background look pretty cool. So there's a theme to not to shower or do anything during menstruation. I don't really get that. These are the showers. Yeah, I think those are supposed to be showers after you've been in the waterfall. That's a nice shower. Although we're not allowed to go during menstruation, FYI women. <laughs> Apparently. So I can't go you, right now. You can't go. <laughs> has epic rocks coming through it. I think we read that this is one of the most popular waterfalls in Bali. So it was like a quick hike over here. It wasn't that far. There were a lot of steps coming down. We're dreading the Stairmaster going back up. <laughs> so I like the green around it. The green is really nice. Yeah, it is pretty loud. Uh, there are red signs out that say no swim today. Maybe the water's a little higher than usual. There's a good amount of water coming down here. I think it's super strong. I was always wondering if you can just stand in there, but this one, I don't think you can. Uh, it's also a pretty decent sized river that goes away from it. Overall, down here, definitely one of the cooler waterfalls I've seen in my life. So we've found a recurring theme. In Bali, there's always ticket checks. Ticket to go up to the middle slash top of the waterfall. We're here, might as well do it. We'll see what it's like. It's 15 each, 
so about a, a little over a dollar not bad the issue is this feels like an additional person just set up i don't understand why you wouldn't just do 30 at the beginning it's just to get another dollar if yeah you can just take two dollars in the beginning yeah it yeah it's shady. just feels a little uncomfortable and weird oh, a donation for a second picture and a pretty nice view actually Phil, you better be careful. You're just halfway up the waterfall. Yeah, you have a quite nice view about the river. It's cool because you're a little closer. And downstairs, there you can because the pool is there. I hope you can go up all the way without paying another time. But you can hear it, you can feel how much water is and how powerful it is. It's pretty cool, it's an awesome waterfall. It's kind of scary. <laughs> We're right on the edge. Vienna's afraid of heights. Well, if you look over, it's when you get uncomfortable. But it's nice. This is kind of worth it because there's no one else here. You don't have to wait for photos. You don't have people in the background of your photos. It's uh, not as many people. Every now and then somebody comes up here. But the second yeah. entrance fee prevents too many people to come up. Yeah, here. yeah. So it's nice. Maybe that's why they do it. I don't know. But it's better than just charging double. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, then everyone would come up here. So up to people like, nah. Oh my god, be careful. waterfall is right around that corner and the river comes down the mountains from up there yeah. that's very nice nobody goes here there's just the one guy stacking stones which is pretty cool and yeah. this girl posing for pictures in a bikini I'm putting my feet in this nice water I'm surprised no one's here everyone goes straight to like the bars and the swings yeah, yeah. top of the waterfall there are these uh, restaurants that you can sit in there's a lot of swings we can see the start over there up there's where we came from you gotta go down the stairs there somewhere yeah. on that side there are the restaurants we're above the waterfall right here and it's pretty loud music playing and I guess you can eat stuff and there's also this big, these two big swings in the background which you can like swing yeah. above the waterfall they canyon. They kind of look terrifying because there's nothing underneath you. It's just they like tie you in with a rope and then they push you and I'm like oh my god yeah, I was But you're strapped in. Diana just said people wearing shirts in the water happens a lot on cruise ships. I'm just surprised. The first time in Asia I saw people going into the water with their shirts on and you see it regularly. I never saw that. I feel like it's normal like whether you're on a cruise ship or like a popular beach in Miami there'll be a few people with shirts on maybe to protect themselves from the sun or just because they but rather the wear water? shirts. Yeah. In Miami. Well, on the beach yes you can leave your shirt on but in the water? I'm, I'm not 100% sure, I don't want to speak for all of America, but I, I feel like it's not uncommon. Nothing to make you feel more out of shape than stairs. <laughs> I'm so gross. No thanks, but I'll take it very Thank you. Thank you. Ah, thank no you. Thanks. Not this time. <laughs> thank you. Well, Made it back to the scooter. Um, it was a nice experience getting a little busier now. So it's nice that we're leaving. It was definitely an awesome waterfall. Yeah. I think we're gonna get some food now. I'm hungry. I want food. We up the restaurant on the coast. Yes. So we're heading to the east coast. Check out that restaurant. To get food. <laughs> Uh, 
Nazi Kampur. Yeah. Nazi is rice. Kampur is a selection. Yeah, like it's a variety of different variety foods. of rice with a variety of stuff. Nazi yeah. Kampur. <laughs> so I've been killing it. There's this ground chicken on a stick. I think it's chicken. I ate mine already, but that's Phil's. <laughs> There's a lot of like good things in here, a lot of tempeh, vegetables and rice, some pork over there. This sauce right here is really good. It's spicy with like shallots, some peppers. So we have the tempeh, some greens, and then the rice with it. Here my mat sauce. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like it. Just ate at this restaurant. It's on the east coast. They were so sweet, and I we ate way too much. <laughs> it's a good place. We wish we were closer because we'd probably come again. Time to go to the beach, though, right? I'm stuck. My backpack stuck with my chest. Oh my shirt. god, he's so stupid. <laughs> Why? Because the the chest. This is underneath it. Yeah, this is the first time we're on the east coast. It's pretty calm. There's nobody here. Yeah. It's another of these dark sand beaches. Yeah, the volcanic, volcanic ash sand. of yeah. sand. There's no one really sunbathing, but there is a lot of uh, pollution and like turned up on this. And far in the background, I don't know if you can see that right now. Uh, we just got a first glimpse of all these green awesome. higher mountains and they look awesome. For today, unfortunately, it's a little bit too far. It takes another one and a half hours to go to that yeah. temple with that gate. We'll go there some at some point. But yeah, we just checked out the Tagenagan waterfall. waterfall. It kind of reminded me of Manoa Falls on Oahu. It's not that long. It's like about a less than a mile hike down there. So a lot of people can do it, but then it also is like the most popular and the busiest waterfall. Yeah, so. yeah like you said, it feels pretty commercialized because you can park right there yeah. and it's just two minutes away. So Super a lot easy. of people. The waterfall itself is awesome. It's yeah. beautiful. Just the adventure factor is not that high. If you want to hike to one, we're going to venture out again and look for other yeah. ones. We're gonna look for some intense hiking ones. <laughs> so we're pleased. Overall, pretty good day. Anyway, we're gonna end the video here on the beach. Let us know in the comments below what you think. Let us know if you would pay the extra 15,000 rupee to go to the top, the yeah. second secret level. And if you like the video, as always, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to your channel if you haven't already. And we're gonna see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Triceratops. Five minutes old.